This segment is brought to you by the Kansas Soybean Commission. The Soybean Checkoff, progress powered by Kansas farmers. Welcome back to Farm Factor. Let's join Dwayne and John Mulhagen as they talk about Molly Manufacturing's new hydraulic loading cattle chute. Dwayne Taves continuing with coverage from the KSU Beef Stocker Conference in Manhattan. Chance to catch up with John Mulhagen with Molly Manufacturing. And John, uh, I see that uh, some of the equipment that you guys have built for a number of years, a part of this facility here at the Stocker Unit, Give us a, a little update on what things went in initially that you've provided for them here at K-State and, and then what upgrades have been made since. Uh, Dwayne, yes, we, we uh, uh, were originally with these uh, with the Beef Star unit from the very beginning. Uh, we provided uh, a silencer squeeze chutes and an overhead scales and, and alleyways. And actually one of our very first turret gates came in here. And that's been about 10 years ago now. And so it's been a very successful program for us here, and they've been a great partner to work with. Uh, they've had a great, uh, uh, many people throughout the world have shown up here and, and, and looked at our equipment here and, and have done a very good job. As far as uh, the facilities here, they've done uh, some modifications through the years, continue to expand, in fact. And, and I understand that uh, you've got a new piece of equipment here as well this year. Yes, we brought we brought them uh, one of our loading chutes. It's a hydraulic loading chute that uh, uh, we can adjust it for the trailer height, uh, uh, whether it's a truck or a or a stock trailer. And these cattle don't have to jump up or drop down. Very safe to use. We've also added some scales on this unit as it's kind of a scientific uh, look as far as batch weighing. We we also have. Uh, uh, where we have the single animal scales on the silencer, we're going to compare the two and see how close we can get batch weighing with uh, single animals. So it's going to be a good, uh, good uh, research project for us. Obviously, this uh, research institution and uh, all of the work that goes on here at the Stocker Conference, uh, being able to uh, measure uh, the old phrase that if you don't, uh, don't measure, you can't manage, and, and having good weights on these cattle in and out, uh, pretty important. Yes, uh, the more we can, uh, the more we measure these animals, we can figure out what these daily gains are going to be, and, and we can also do so many predictions on what we expect from these animals, and, and then for in the future as well. As far as uh, the lineup from Molly Manufacturing, uh, uh, comfort and safety for the animal, but also the operators, kind of been a, a focal point for a number of years. Yes, you know we've uh, through the years we keep adding on to our silencer squeeze shoots and. Um, uh, we keep making it safer for the operators and the animals. You know, our hydraulic neck bars are just so important now. We can move that head from right to left. Uh, we don't have to worry about people getting hurt by these heads swinging around. Uh, you know, we put hydraulic kick bars in there now, so if we need that extra safety of somebody stepping in behind these animals. Uh, we've also built a larger model for, for more for large cattle now, what we call Silencer Max. So we just keep adding on to our product line with them. Well, our thanks to John Mulhagen with Molly Manufacturing joining us at the KSU Beef Stocker Conference in Manhattan talking about some of the facilities and the equipment located here on site. Jamie, we'll send it back to you for more in studio on Ag AM in Kansas. Thanks, Dwayne. Folks, this week's Kansas Soybean Report is coming up next, so don't go away. This is Farm Factor on Ag AM in Kansas. 